In this video, I'm going to explain about how to respond to comments on Facebook page and Instagram using ChatGPT. So let's get started over here. So first of all, you have to make sure in the integration section, you have to make sure the OpenAI ChatGPT is connected. If not, you can simply get the APX keys from OpenAI platform and connect over here. And once done, we can actually start building uh, the setup over here so first of all uh, we are actually going to use the facebook comment automations and instagram comment automation to achieve uh, to actually respond to comments using ChatGPT. before that we actually need to create a simple chatbot flow to handle the comments and also the respond to the comments using ChatGPT. so let me simply add a flow over here so let me name the flow as my comments on facebook and instagram So let me simply name this one as AI comments on Facebook and Instagram. So here we are in the flow builder over here. So here you have to set up an action over here and make this as the starting step. So once you change the starting step, you can simply remove this one. So this particular action will actually is dedicated to OpenAI to handle the comments. So in the OpenAI, you can simply choose this generate text advanced and here you can choose whatever the model you want to have over here so here the user message will be we actually uh, record the customer users comments in a variable which is called as last fb comment so here fb comment so this actually works for the instagram as well so keep in mind so here you can actually add the business information so actually i created a business information using chat gpt over here so here the chat chatbot knowledge base for a wedding planning agency over here so let me simply add copy paste uh, this particular knowledge base over here paste all right done so i can simply the name of this particular company is blissful beginnings wedding planning agency so let me simply add this one as well all right so it actually have some information about this particular company and we want to respond to this particular customer and so when a particular customer comments this particular add a comment on facebook or instagram this particular this particular comment will be sent to chat gpt and it will actually use this particular business information to respond to the customer so here save response to customer uh, custom field we can simply save this one in a custom field you can name it whatever that you want so i can i actually saving this in the ai comment over here uh, you can actually remove this one and keep temperature 0 0.2 and uh, you can remember the conversation as well and another important thing is that uh, you can actually add a prompt over here if you want to have like precise short responses over there uh, let me add it respond to customers in just one sentence in a friendly way So basically, it simply respond to the customer in just one sentence, just to make sure. Click continue. So now we have done with this particular block. Now we want to simply send that particular response. So here, if you remember, we actually save that particular response generated from the OpenAI in this particular field called AI comment. So you can simply call that field over here. If you type AI and you can simply select that field now you actually done with this particular setup over here so we actually simply created this particular flow now we want to create the automations uh, facebook and com facebook and instagram comment automation separately so let me simply choose facebook comment automation over here let me add the facebook comment automation uh, i can name this as ai comments fb actually this is only for the fb so you can actually name whatever that you want like so you can actually choose specific post or you can easily track all post as well so in this case i'm simply going to track all post and private reply to comment that means uh, when you actually when a particular person comments on your facebook or instagram do you want to send a private reply that means a personalized message to their dms if not you can simply choose none because here we are only going to respond to the customers just using a public comment so we don't need this private reply over here 
so here for the public reply to comment that means just a reply to the comments we can simply choose the flow we just created a comments on facebook and instagram and here you can choose a reply to all comments suppose if you want to reply to only specific comments with specific kind of keywords you can actually do that as well let me choose reply to all comments and here we have some more options as well uh, you can even like the user comment and you can even uh, do not reply to replies to comment if you disable it simply reply to the uh, comments which already replied as well and here you can actually delay the reply otherwise uh, like delay the reply like few minutes seconds hours or you can even send a reply to the comments randomly within these kind of minutes as well uh, here i'm simply choosing immediately over here save so I have saved that one simply activate this one so now we are actually done with the Facebook uh, comment automations so we also need to set up the Instagram comment automations as well so simply choose Instagram comment automation over here and let me create a new one over here let me name as a comment and continue so the beautiful thing about this particular flow builder is that if you choose omni channel it simply works on whatever the channels you select over here and also this particular opening action can also work on all the channels and this particular last fp comments also work for the uh, instagram comment as well so you don't need uh, we actually don't have any kind of variables separately for ig comments you can simply use this particular last fp comments just for the Instagram as well it simply works so here track all comments private reply none public reply you have to simply choose the same flow because everything works the same for the Instagram as well and here you can disable this one and choose immediately and click save so I have just saved it make sure to activate this one so only this one is active over here and likewise for the Facebook we also activated that one as well so now let's test this and how this actually works first of all let me test this on facebook so here we are on the chatting media page so let me you can actually choose whatever the post you want and let me open this particular post and uh, let me add a comment so here let me go to the knowledge base and check the knowledge base uh, so the opening offers office hours on saturday is 10 a.m to 4 p.m so let me ask uh, this particular comment or simply ask this question what is the opening hours on saturdays so let me simply add this comment it says posting and once it's posted i should receive a response as well so let's uh, wait or i can simply refresh this page as well to see what sort of response i have received over here so as you see here we have uh, received the reply as you see here our always open on saturdays from 10 a.m to 4 p.m <clears throat> and we are here to help you plan your dream wedding here we are in the Instagram so I can simply open some random post on Instagram and ask what are the information as well so let me open what is uh, your email address so I just I'm just posting a comment over here as uh, what is uh, your email address so it should respond to me over here let me open this again to see if it okay it's not loading i guess okay it's actually responded to me over here and it says our email address is info at blissful beginnings weddings dot com it simply respond as you see here so like this you can actually test this on whatever the post or reels it actually simply works for both both post and reels as well so that's how we actually set up uh, the automation to respond to comments using chat gpt on facebook and instagram if you have any questions let us know in the comments thank you